hello welcome welcome back to the channel it's your girl barbara yeah so if you're new to the channel please hit on that subscribe button down below so you never miss an upload from me as you can already tell from the title today i'm going to be sharing with you guys a realistic day in my life with a newborn So I'm starting this vlog with a somehow photo shoot. Look at my baby smiling. Look at him. Look at him. He's like, mommy, you taking too many pictures. I know that's what moms do. That's what new moms do. So yeah, I'm just trying to capture some moments. So I started this vlog trying to take him some pictures. I have shared this outfit with you guys in what I have packed in my hospital bag. This is something I used on my second son. So I just wanted to use that to capture some pictures for him for just our memory yeah which was not a successful one but it's all about the memory right this video is just a memory too so yeah just continue to watch the video hope you do enjoy it if you do so please give it a thumbs up and enjoy a realistic day in my life as a new mom yes baby here baby here baby here yeah. I can show you what love is supposed to feel like. I can show you what love is supposed to be. I can show you what love is supposed to feel like. Your legs are so tiny. So guys. His legs are so tiny. The shoes can't even hold. I have a new LED light that I bought a couple of weeks back. But I haven't unboxed it. So I just don't have time. Even my hospital bag is still sitting here. I haven't just had the time to... But it's getting cold so I'm gonna wrap him up daddy we didn't get any picture so yeah my mom is downstairs hubby is also down working the girls they didn't go to school today they are just working they're just playing around going up and down the stairs but so far so good we're not cooking today so I have time baby boy is soon gonna sleep I just gave him his like half bath I need to put on his clothes. I just wanted to try and see if I can look at <laughs> baby boy. Let's show you a little, little <laughs> photo shoot outfit. You guys saw this in my what I packed in my hospital bag. I use this for my second son. My mom and my husband they are just chit chatting. I can hear them talking. I wish I was ready for a photo shoot with him. I haven't taken any photo shoot with him. But I'm still having four kids. It's not a big deal. I'm here. I need my quiet time. Which movie? Let me slide to come check. Um, so, do we still have that part? 
It's in the freezer there. You have to put it in water to defrost. In the freezer that. Uh, no, in the kitchen. The little mini one. Pull that thing and then the second. Mm -hmm. You see it's got that there. Put it in water to defrost. Mama, keep that shoe. Why did you go and change? You don't listen, right? These girls, they love to go and change their clothes. <laughs> oh gosh. Oh, baby boy. You want to say hi to the camera? <laughs> I was going to try another outfit, like an African kind of, you know, beads. Just put on him. But clearly this is not working out. The lighting might seem, the sun is really out. The lighting might seem to be working but the thing is i put this thing on the floor for him so it's kind of low so the lighting don't come like down it reflects up so as you can see i'm holding him up like this the lighting is kind of good but when i put him down like this and i adjust the camera it's not doing justice so let me see i try to take a couple on my phone because I pumped this morning I didn't share that with you guys because I didn't plan on vlogging I pumped this morning I got two bottles I always get two bottles each time I pump I could do it morning and evening but I just don't have the patience too so I'm gonna try to improve on that but right now I'm doing solely breastfeeding <laughs> I think this is like my first baby I'm doing like exclusive not my first baby like I did it with the others but not long with my first one, I did it for like where well, I combined it, but I breastfed for like eight months. Second, maybe like four, or maybe more than four, but the twins, like three months, because I couldn't just have that. I didn't have that patient to sit and breastfeeding takes time, you know. So I just didn't have. I had other things to do. Daddy, daddy. That this boy, this boy kept me up all night yesterday. He didn't sleep. You did not sleep. <laughs> and I woke up this morning. And I was telling his dad. His dad woke up for like a couple of times. But during the week he worked. So I let him just sleep. But I was telling him, man. You need to pay me. <laughs> they need to pay me to take care of my own baby. <laughs> yeah, so I was just telling him that. Because I let him sleep. I mean, I'm considerate, you know when his chance he gets up and you know if you guys want to see like a night typical night routine like night like oh, midnight overnight all throughout the night newborn <laughs> i'm gonna show you guys that an index trust me i'm gonna show you guys how i stay up at night thank god for phone social media i'll be watching youtube videos doing my thing and sometimes he's even sleeping and my eyes are still like kind of dry i don't want to sleep <laughs> you know but yeah Daddy, ma. so we have mama, we have papa, we have this is daddy. I used to give, I used Jesse is a big boy, I used to call him daddy, but I've switched it so now I've given daddy to this one. So I have special boys in my house. If you guys don't know, my first son is named after my father in law from my ex husband, and my second son is named after my current father-in-law <laughs> don't judge me <laughs> current father-in-law and then this baby is named after my daddy so this is daddy hmm. daddy daddy so yeah they are just so special to me all of them are special so special my first son my ex father in law oh my gosh he loved me so much, loved me so, so, so much, and I hold him dear to my heart. I respect, I love and respect all of these men, you know, my two father-in-laws, ex and current. So I'm glad I named them after, I named my kids after them, because it means a lot to me. I know some people will be like, oh, you give them their own name, but people do things differently. I'm from Africa and, you know. <laughs> we pass names down especially traditional names so yeah they are all special to me i love them so dear 
and this is my daddy mama daddy daddy wants to sleep you want to eat some more do you want to eat some more do you do you do you do you do you let's go down let me dress you up let me go change your clothes okay let's go let me go put your clothes Typical life of a mom tuber. Yes, the baby has eaten. I've changed him so he's completely fine. So I just put him down so I can multitask and edit a video that was supposed to be going up the next day. So this is just me doing that. So this is life. This is life. Welcome to my world. This is life. Pair of jeans, a shirt or two. We didn't pack as if we weren't and going back. It doesn't matter if it's true. I've got a feeling love will give us what we lack. The world is waiting up. The world is waiting half a step beyond our door. Yeah. And if it's not enough. I wanna see the stuff the world has got in store. Uh, I wanna take it on and So guys, just let me talk to you guys a bit. Baby's back there, he's just moving, he refused to sleep in there. Yeah. So he's up but he's quiet. So I did a little bit of editing. I'm still editing because this video needs to go up tomorrow. If you're new to my channel, thank you so much for clicking on this video. I upload three times a week, Sunday, Tuesdays and Thursdays. So yeah, right now I've been putting out content. I've been consistent with those days. And if I have extra video, but I try not to put like extra video on other days. I want to stick to that schedule just so you know days that I have to upload and you run to my channel, you're going to see a video. I don't have a particular time, but anything before 12 noon central time, you'll find a video on there. So yes, guys. I'm gonna take a break now I have some schoolwork submission to do yes I'm also in school I have some schoolwork to do and this semester is almost over I have a couple semesters to go yeah so I can't wait to be done but school at OH it's never too late right yeah anyways 
what time is it it's 102 right now hubby is going to pick up the kids from school only the boys went to school today the girls all of them are going in tomorrow because the girls do go in twice a week tuesdays and thursday so i plan to film that for you guys tomorrow i don't know if i'm gonna be able to do that i wanted to carry you out carry you guys throughout the routine show you guys how we're still coping how we're doing things my mom is here no doubt but trust me she didn't really come here to help me for a move with my mom she's old not that old she's getting tired so i didn't bring her here to like help me she's here just to like enjoy the moment spend time with her grandkids me cooking for her so she can eat she also cooked for me but she enjoy when i just cook for her she loves roasted fish a lot so yeah i'm gonna be making that tomorrow again the last one we had was a couple of days back so she's just here to just enjoy some moment create memories with her grandkids and me and my husband stuff like that so she's not here to she don't have that strength to really really help me like that and i just thank god for the strength that i'm able to do my own things you know so guys baby's just here hubby is working out there my mom is there they are just chit chatting while he's working the girls are watching their ipad it's a beautiful weather but oh well yeah i don't want this video to be too long i have other things that i want to do but i'm gonna save it for a different day i'm gonna be cleaning my closet one of these days taking out things purging taking out things that don't fit me anymore because I've been decluttering a lot, but some there are still some things that I held on to that I'm like, okay, it's gonna fit me. You know, as you grow, your style do change. So, come on, baby, come on, baby. That dim, that dim, that dim, come, 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 boo, 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 boo. It's okay, now. It's okay. I just gave him breast milk but I don't want to breastfeed him again because my boobs are sore right now so they need a break I did pump this morning I mentioned that earlier I pumped two bottles so yeah he can have that if he needs something but I don't think he needs anything maybe I'll give him gripe water now because the last he had it was maybe like two hours ago or maybe three or two four hours so I'm gonna give him gripe water sometimes the first when their tummy is kind of like upset because you know they have to poop all that um, my mom used to call it rope rope poop so yeah this is my feet baby i'm kind of used to so last night he's been sleeping really good for the past since we got home but yesterday was not a good day i literally did not sleep and i'm that person that i don't know how to sleep during the day during the day i'm just like energetic on my feet i just like to do other things and at night i get my rest but yeah i'm fine for now if i do feel sleepy i'm gonna take a nap but right now i'm okay not cooking today yesterday we cooked i cooked dole yesterday my mom don't like dole so she made something for herself she's kind of picky somehow not really but somehow so yeah i'm gonna go ahead and end the vlog here and in another video i'm gonna show you guys maybe a two weeks postpartum he's gonna be two weeks in two days so i'll try to show you guys my postpartum belly i started <laughs> let me leave it for that video i started like using the postpartum belly wrap that i got from amazon i'm gonna share that with you guys in an upcoming video and i think it really works great so if you're looking for one just stay tuned and look forward to that video i'm gonna upload it so yes guys thank you so much for watching this video to all my new subscribers i see you guys in your numbers like they say there's always light at the end of the tunnel when i posted my label and delivery vlog this is not the first time i'm posting label and delivery vlog but the way this one skyrocketed is that how they say it guys it's like finally youtube kind of heard my cry and they were recommending my videos they were recommending my video and i took time to film to rec i took time to vlog you know i believe that's a very good video for someone a new mom you want to see the process of labor and delivery even for someone who is not a mom or someone maybe even men you know sometimes just so you you can see how the process even though mine was kind of a little bit fast but it still kind of gave you guys the idea of what labor and delivery is all about so i think that was a good video and people sh um 
youtube did recommend that video and people were subscribing to my channel and it felt so good you know just it felt so good and it's just a good motivation i just want to thank you guys so much of course i do youtube because i really really love it of course the money comes in very very handy too but yeah i was so 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 happy it just feels good to know that all your hard work didn't go in vain yeah i really thank you guys so much for joining the family hope you guys have been liking what you're seeing so far you can go back and watch my old videos and i promise to keep you guys updated as we grow <laughs> i promise to keep you guys updated with the baby so i post three times a week sunday tuesdays and thursdays so always look out for that video anytime before noon central time you will have a video on this channel so yes guys i just want to take this moment to thank you so much it's not taken for granted i really really appreciate i'm humbled I really really appreciate me go continue to bless you guys like I just believe it was just that timing that timing because I believe in timing so God did it for me you know I know not every subscriber will stick to the channel because I post a variety of content lifestyle I'm a mother mother of five so I post different videos lifestyle sometimes fashion I mean anything that <clears throat> I deem necessary to film but if you have any idea something you want to see on this channel your wish is my command so just leave it in the comment section below and I will be sure to film that for you guys. Yes, I have the time. <laughs> As you can see, I'm bored right now. I'm carrying this baby soon. He's going to go to sleep and I won't have anything to do. I already took my shower. When he sleeps, I'm going to do some schoolwork. Not that, not a lot. I'm just going to do some schoolwork. And I already cleaned the house. It's okay. So I do have time. I have time. I can do it so yes guys the only thing like some videos you have to do makeup and it's always hard to do makeup man it's hard man it's hard because when you do makeup you want to film at least two to three to four videos you want to make use of that makeup because you don't know when you're gonna do makeup again so yeah i just avoid that for now but yep so guys thank you guys so much i love you guys and i'll see you guys in my next videos Thank you guys so very much if you find this video helpful interesting motivating inspiring in one way or the other please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and if you haven't subscribed to the channel please do so so you never miss an upload from me please share the video with your friends and family give them something to entertain themselves that will mean so so much to me thank you so much for all the love and support and on that note i'll see you guys in my next video my mom and my husband they can chit chat they can chit chat I can hear them talking. Okay, I'm about to watch this video right now. I know I promised to end the video, but I was just browsing to YouTube. I have my airport. I have my airport right here. So I'm gonna watch this video. This is by Joshua Apostle Joshua Selman and he says learn to forgive if you want to move forward I always talk about it I've said it in my channel before I've said it on this channel before forgiveness is very important you're not doing it you're not doing it for the other person it's more so for yourself it's very very important to forgive forgive unforgiveness is a sin you are disturbing your mind though. the other person is there cruising sleeping perfectly where you are there having hatred in your heart reducing your your, your lifespan it's not worth it so i'm about to watch that this is short normally his videos are really long sometimes i go to bed with them like just sleep with them and it makes me feel so good because i learn a lot his teachings are amazing you know so i'm about to watch this right now so check if you want to watch that i watch it on salvation tv on youtube you can check it out and the title is learn to forgive people apostle joshua selman yeah so my mouth is kind of dry. I drink a lot of water. Sometimes I drink like maybe five of these. I always take one, a full bottle put by my bedside and I drink it before morning. Yeah, and sometimes I do snack at night. After breastfeeding, you get so hungry. Last night, what I snacked on was um, I had a pack of M&Ms and I want to reduce on that. I don't want to eat a lot of sweets, but it was just a small pack. So I ate that last night. And sometimes I would go to the kitchen get some yogurt or some granola bar. You know, after breastfeeding, you get so hungry. Yeah. And I try to keep myself hydrated. So, mm, 